It's the groundbreaking of the construction of a 150 to 200 bed permanent emergency and infectious diseases hospital worth $1.2 million. <laughs> Dignitaries arrive at the Imo State University Teaching Hospital Olu for the event. For NNPC and Seplat, the facility is one of 12 hospitals they intend to construct across the six geopolitical zones of the country to strengthen national health care facilities in the fight against COVID-19 and other infectious diseases. Since we had the very first index case in February of this year, we have been watching as the numbers increase very astronomically, and it therefore means that we can no longer fold our hands and watch, but to join hands with the global community in the fight against this pestilence. We are very happy to be working in both state and operating in Imo state. Uh, we have very many more plans. In addition to the gas plant that is uh, ABC Ojako has mentioned, we are also looking forward to establishing another modular refinery, uh, specifically a condenser refinery in Imo state. The multi-million dollar project is one of the three categories of the oil and gas industry intervention initiatives on COVID-19. And the Minister of State for Petroleum, Timmy Press Silva, believes it will go a long way towards relieving the burden on existing facilities. The intervention initiative is in alignment with the ongoing federal government effort to curb the pandemic through the Presidential Task Force on COVID-19. The choice of Imo State as the site for the project is a decision Governor Hope Uzodima considers laudable to complement efforts of health workers in the state. With the construction of this specialist hospital, the threat of contagious diseases such as coronavirus, AIDS, otherwise known as acquired immune deficiency syndrome, cholera, Ebola, avian influenza or bird flu, or even hepatitis, can be effectively controlled and contained. The governor then performs the groundbreaking of the proposed hospital. The proposed permanent emergency and infectious diseases hospital by Seplat and the NNPC is expected to serve the entire southeast region. A similar event earlier held in Katsina State for the northwest region Borno State for the Northeast and Bielsa State in the South-South.